Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a delicious recipe for you. I'm calling it my chocolate bananas foster recipe. And I wanted to share this with you guys today because it's the holiday season and everyone's drinking things like eggnog. And there's definitely some vegan eggnogs out there, but some of us don't like the taste of eggnog or we maybe want a break from eggnog. So this is a delicious holiday drink that you can make that will keep you staying healthy. Mm -hmm. There's no added sugar in this. Mm. But it is definitely sweet. It's a nice sweet treat. You can have this just as is as I make it. Or if you add a little bourbon in there, if you're of age, I will tell. So yeah, this recipe is super delicious. Let's get into it. This video is actually part two of a three part series where I bring you delicious recipes and tips to help you stay healthy, maintain weight, and even lose weight during the holidays. This is what you'll need to make the recipe. You'll need nutmeg. I'm using about half a tablespoon. Cinnamon for garnish. You'll need some vanilla ice cream. I'm using this So Delicious Oat Ice Cream. It's made from oat milk. Very tasty. And I'll show you in a minute, but one thing I like about that ice cream is you can actually see the real vanilla in it. You'll need one banana. You can freeze it, or if it's not frozen, it's okay because we're gonna add ice anyway. And I'm using this delicious Cacao Bliss. This is so good, you guys. It has so many superfoods in there. And you've seen me use this before. It's just something that I love to use. I probably have a cup of that as a hot cocoa every night. But it's so fun to come up with recipes for it. So this is a nice added chocolatey taste to this Bananas Foster's recipe. So here is the vanilla ice cream. Looks so creamy. I don't know if you can ever make a recipe with ice cream and not have a few tablespoons <laughs> as you go along. I definitely did. So you're gonna need about a cup of ice. And here I'm just putting the ice in. I'm gonna add the banana. And after I add the banana, I'm adding in that half a tablespoon of nutmeg. Here goes the ice cream. That's about a cup of vanilla vegan ice cream and I just wanted to show you guys what it's looking like right now looks so good super yummy you'll also need one scoop of the cacao bliss and I'm using about a half a cup of orange juice. One thing I like about this orange juice is even though it's not organic, it doesn't have any added sugar. So it's that 365 brand from Whole Foods. It's just oranges in there. That's all. One ingredient, which is really good. All the sweetness is coming from the natural fruits of the banana and the orange juice. So you just want to blend that up. It's nice when you don't have to add a lot of liquid because you get it nice and creamy. And you know what the saying is when it comes to making smoothies or blending anything in your blender. The longer you blend it for, the creamier it'll get. So I'm just going to keep blending it up until it gets super, super creamy. Definitely in the market for a new blender, but hey, this one has been working pretty good for me all this time. Look how nice and creamy it gets. So yeah, I was inspired to make this recipe from a cocktail recipe book that I have. And I thought, why not make something healthy something that you can have during the holidays and stay on track with your 
weight maintenance or weight loss journey. It's always nice to have additional recipes in your back pocket to make when you get craving for something like this chocolatey and sweet and delicious. One of the things I really like about this cacao bliss is that it adds an additional support for mental focus. It also boosts your energy and it reduces cravings. So as you're enjoying this, you can feel satisfied and know that, oh, you're not gonna wanna have something right after. You're gonna be super satisfied. And um, it's a, definitely a satisfying treat. I would have it as a dessert or even as like a smoothie in the daytime. Well, thank you so much to Cacao Bliss for sponsoring this video. I will definitely leave you guys some coupon codes in the description box so you can get a discount on Cacao Bliss. And if you decide to try this recipe, let me know. Or if you're thinking about trying it, let me know in the comments what you think. And I will see you in the next video.